Hey, Linnell. Hi, good to see you. Well, good to hear you again. <laughs> How are you doing, okay? I'm doing great, thanks. Well, as you can tell, I'm not from the Canton Repository. That's right, I knew that much. <laughs> Um, but I am here to tell you and inform you that our selection committee met a little over a week ago. And ah. I wanted to share with you so that you could share with the rest of your family very confidentially. But I do want to thank you for all that your father did for this game. Um, thank you. And I want to let you know that he is going to be in Canton, Ohio for the rest of time as a member of the Pro Football Hall of Fame. Thank and I you. promise you on behalf of all of us who love the game, that we are going to guard his legacy forever. Oh, I appreciate that. We want to invite you and uh, uh, you know members of your family to come here to Canton and to have an orientation with us, uh, to talk about what's going to happen. The selectors really loved what your dad did for the game. And there's such an emphasis on inclusion now. But your dad is the first African-American contributor in the history of the Hall of Fame. Oh, that's he's wonderful. He's not a player and a coach. And I believe yeah. last time you and I talked, when I mentioned that he was nominated, uh, I believe you told me afterwards that it was kind of one of the last smiles that your mom ever had. You know? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was a... I'll never forget that day. That's right. What That's was, right. What was that like? Well, you know, she, as I, as I told you before, she was, she was uh, on hospice care, and um, she, you know, she really wasn't awake most of the time. But you know, I guess we were hooping and hollering so loudly that she, she sort of opened her eyes, and we told her, and uh, she said. You know, we told her Nunny's going to be in the Hall of Fame, and uh, and she she seemed like she was happy to hear it. And that was, uh, you know, she she actually did pass away later that evening. Well, yeah. Listen, I happen to be driven by a little bit of faith, so I think they're both together now. <laughs> uh, we're going to make this very very special for you, okay? Thank you. And. and uh, Again, we're very curious about this thing being in legacy. As a result of Bill and some other things that have happened, you know, when the weekend itself comes, and there will be five new members from the Pittsburgh Steelers into the Hall of Fame. You know, I, I guess that's never happened before that you had two years. We, we've, we've never in... had three, much less five, and, and, and uh, who are going in together. And one of the people, Donnie Shell. Yeah. To be one of the guys that your dad went and found. Oh. Absolutely. Absolutely. Oh, it's uh it's it's really, really a blessing. Our goal, our mission, is to honor the heroes of the games. Of which your dad, even though he wasn't on the playing field, your dad is a hero of the game. To preserve its history. He's part of its history. You can't tell the history now of the NFL without talking about Bill Nunn. To promote its values. Uh, your dad, from everything I've heard, was a man of great value and, and courage and character and caring uh, from, from what Tony Dungy and, uh, you know, uh, Mel Blunt and, and um, Joe Green and others tell me. Um, and, and then it's to celebrate excellence. So we want to find a way of celebrating the excellence of everyone. If you have any problem, you give me a call. Okay, Linnell? Okay, thank you. It's nice talking to you again. Very nice. Okay. <laughs>